Hi, welcome to blog.web6.org. In today's video, we are going to learn about Finder and opening or closing application. Finder is actually like Window Explorer in Windows. So if you are using Windows, it's called Windows Explorer to uh, navigate and look for your files. And in Mac, you are going to use Finder. So you see that Finder is actually in the very left side here on the dock if by default. And then if you're going to uh, you said you're going to just click once and you are on Finder. Here you're going to see what uh, folder you have, such as uh, here all of your files, the PDF documents and the other documents, or you can you go to application folder where your application uh, and programs are, such as iPhone, uh, sorry, iPhoto, iTunes and so forth. And desktop is here and now it's very empty. so desktop is empty as well and your documents and downloads if you download you will have something here and movies and then uh, music and pictures so at the moment it's still empty but whenever you have new file you can save anything here so that's finder and uh, you see if I close that window now and open finder again you see it's says all my files but you can actually change it for example I don't want to see this all my files I want to see my desktop uh, my desktop is highlighted if for the first time I open it so how you do that you go to here to the very uh, top left corner and you go to finder and go to preference you see that uh, here you can actually uh, customize what you want and you find the window show all my files which is that I just show you and in fact you can uh, navigate it and what you want you can view desktop for example and uh, I usually always open folders in new window and I usually click that so you can try if you want and let's try it, try it. and then labels you can choose the colors and sidebar this is the sidebar and basically that's all so now I'm going to close it and let open the finder again by file and you find a window you see it shows me my desktop before it was showing all my files so that's how you do it and now we're closing the finder now we are talking about closing and uh, opening applications so let's say we're going to open um, Safari which is very common it's very nice browser of uh, Mac and if you are opening Safari you see that here you have uh, uh, like uh, traffic lights but it's actually red yellow and green so I'm going to hit OK you see now and then if you uh, go here you can close it minimize and maximize let's close it you see now it's it's uh, closed and then if you minimize it will minimize here in this dock you see in Mac you can actually see that uh, all minimized uh, stuff will go to this part of the dock so you don't have to see here if uh, what kind of application I actually open or minimize then you can click on this one and open it again and if you maximize why it's shrinked it's actually uh, closed because maximize that means that the biggest window it, it is possible for example if I uh, drag and uh, drag and resize the win this window I usually resize as big as possible on my screen like this and then like this and if I minimize again and then maximize again and then this is actually the smallest uh, the biggest screen that I can get and you see that uh, on the dock as you can see now you see that there is some um, like glowing part of shadow of this uh, uh, related application that shows that this application is on or uh, running so 
at the moment finder is running safari is running and my um, screen recorder is running now if you close this safari you usually in windows you just click that red button and it will close so it's in mac it will close but watch out this one still has glowing part which means that application is still running even you don't see any window I don't see it here you see it's not minimized but I just close that uh, red button to close the window it can be seen here on the top that Safari is still running to close it to really close that Safari application that it's not running anymore you're going to click that and quit Safari or you can use command and key Q uh, keys all at once. So just quit Safari and this glowing part is actually gone. So it's kind of different than on Windows. At first I was not used to it but uh, I find it's very nice when when you opening many application and you see that you have to uh, go here and hit quit. Just one thing that uh, we have to remember that one application that you cannot close is Finder because like in Windows you cannot um, shut down the Windows Explorer otherwise the system will crash so a Finder you cannot close it except a Finder you can close any of these for example like iCal now I don't need this iCal anymore I just close that uh, window it's still running you see that here so it's iCal you have to uh, press comment and Q uh, keys or you just quit iCall and yes using this uh, navigate with your mouse and click that quit iCall so that's actually how you open and closing application so see you in the next videos thank you for watching